play softball because it's what I love to do. I don't do anything that I don't love to do. I feel like it builds my character. It's just a really fun thing to do. I had PE in freshman year and I got, it was really boring and I didn't like PE so I decided sophomore year I joined softball. What interested me in softball was started when I was young, grew into it, here I am. Uh, what inspires me to coach these girls? Um, honestly, the level of coaching, just in general, to see the improvement from where they started to where they finished. Like I said, I fell in love with the sport. I play softball because I love it, and I'm surrounded by family and friends, so yeah. Um, overall, you know, it's we're one big family. When we're on the field, when we're off the field. My experience with Grant Softball has been amazing. It has taught me what it means to be a team and how to work together and how that plays a huge role in success. Last year during Grant Softball season, we didn't win very much. We lost a lot. We lost by a lot. And that was because we didn't work together as a team. We didn't have very good communication. We had bad attitudes and a lot of different things that played a role in us losing. This year is different though. We work together, we know how to be a team, we communicate very well, attitudes are better, and right now we are 5-2, and two. we are winning, and with us working together as a team and communicating well, I hope that we can continue that and continue working hard. Even though many of us are friends and we all get along, I feel like the majority of some girls don't really like each other, don't really know each other that well, so sometimes we have differences and that can, we need to work on that a lot. Okay, so my experience during softball like, the past three years has been all right. I mean, the last two years were like basically horrible since we lost a lot. We didn't know how to communicate and we didn't work as a team. But this year is like super different. Like we've all gotten like closer. We know how to act towards like one another and we've actually won more than the games that won before. And like we've won by a lot as well. Um, I guess one of the most bad experiences was one of our teammates leaving just because she didn't know how to handle it all and we like we were all so close and having her leave kind of sucked. I don't know, I guess having her leave made the team worse, but she's back now and she's actually our catcher now and she she's just amazing and like we all love her and I guess I'm kind of sad this is my last year, but I'm glad that I joined softball before it was too late. I had to leave the team towards the end of the season. I got to start with the girls, but I had to leave them like mid-season, so that was really sad for me. I got to see them like go on to playoffs, and I wasn't a part of that, so that really broke my heart. We've had um, multiple instances where we're not a family on the team, and that's what causes our downfall. But I can say this year has been the best year because we're more of a family and we connect more. My message to my seniors would be, you know, take this success that you got and go with it. Don't let your success end in softball or in high school. Continue to strive to be great and become winners. Grand out three, grand out three. One, two, three. Grand!